Right, where are we now? We started the week with billionaires taking over the sport. Then Tuesday, we saw the fans fight back. Scenes on Fulham Road. During the brief lifespan of the European Super League, the Carabao Cup final had already begun to look like a disfranchised occasion in the modern history of English football. I mean, for a start, it was of course named the Carabao Cup, an awkward competition that just got in the way of bigger occasions. Adding to this, we have two finalists that signed up to the Super League. Both club owners have openly stated they don't care about the Football League. I mean... Does anybody actually want to do this? Yes, the supporters. Whichever way it swings, the fans of either club will be delighted to win a trophy. Additionally, Wembley will open its doors to 8,000 spectators today, which makes it officially the first game back in English football with fans attending. To make this game more tasty, Jose Mourinho got the sack last Sunday, denied even a final face-off with his old rival. They don't give me privacy. Even my friend Gary... Is this me? That's my life. And he was replaced by the most elite and prestigious manager around. No, I'm kidding. An inexperienced 29-year-old Ryan Mason. All we know is he got off to a good start with a 2-1 win over Brighton without Harry Kane. So let's get over to Wembley, find out how they'll host this first event back with fans, what the restrictions will be, how the atmosphere will differ, and the final match conclusion. If you're feeling nice, subscribe for more. Guys, thank you for selling out in 19 minutes. I can't believe that you'll never get a chance to buy this again. But my goodness, the cup final today. You know what, I think Man City will be a little bit too strong. I think it'll be a tight, tense game. I'm going Man City 1, Tottenham 0. Is there's one thing that has to be done before we get in the stadium. Covid test done. My nose, oh, I hate it, but it's, it's been done. We've got Brendan here, City fan, massive City fan, season ticket holder. You're back at the ground today. How does it feel to be back? It's really bizarre. We don't yeah. know. We don't know what it's going to be like. We're going to be sitting there with loads of space around us. Yeah. I don't know. It's going to be weird. I just don't know. Yeah. But we're we're going to find out today. The first one. That's, yeah. Uh, got spectators back. So. For sure. Yeah, For sure. Exciting. Score predictions then. What do you What do you reckon? It's going to be close. I think. Yeah. City haven't been playing that well. You were just telling me Kane's going to be playing. Yeah. Uh, I reckon it's going to be close. 1 0 City, I reckon. 1 0 City. City. Who do you think will score? Yeah, could be anyone. Really? Gun do it. Oh, he did it last time, didn't he? Yeah. This season. Yes. So, yeah. I don't know. I've seen a few good games there, I don't think he is. But, yeah. Um, I don't think this will be a good one. Fair play. So, Fair play. Yeah. But it's just good to be back. Now, yeah. So. That's the main thing. And yeah. you've got the brew dogs, which is key. Got the beers. Dog dad will be proud. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> predictions today what are you going for uh, i said 3-0 city 3-0 city I've got, I've got most of city fans yeah and fans. yeah well city are favorites aren't they it's a tough one yeah if kane starts you never know but city yeah. have a great team if he's in the team is good because for the euros it's good news exactly you know, exactly no can feel it through the first half all good all good lads take care so here we are here we are loads of city fans very busy at wembley here very busy. People have got beers, there are snacks and food. I thought that might be closed, but it's not. Pretty cool. Right, get ready to soak this in. This is the moment we're back at the ground. Bang. And take a look at this. A little bit of design going on, on the city end. And the Spurs end is over there. We are back in the stadiums. Big up James Trafford there behind the goal, if you can see him. What a guy, what a guy. Right there. Shame is Nando's order isn't as good as mine. The Spurs fans are over there in the sun as you can see. The players have just gone over to clap them. What a big result this would be for 29 year old Ryan Mason as the gaffer to get his first trophy for Spurs. I have to give credit to Wembley and the way this Carabao Cup game has been set up. It was very easy to get in. We got the COVID test back in about 30 minutes from a text from NHS. We showed that to someone going in and that was it. You could get to your seat, food and drink was available, even beers, which is just crazy. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs>
the reactions and smiles of City and Tottenham fans just being able to watch their team again was absolutely amazing as well. Harry Kane starts for Spurs. And for people wondering how I know James Trafford, basically ages ago, loads of people were saying, oh, he's my twin. Because in one Academy England game, he looked like me, which is so funny. And he basically kept up with the band, so we've kept in touch ever since. So really good lad. And it's great to see him progressing so well. No Super League, but this this will do. <laughs> First game is back with fans, with spectators. The stewards are telling the fans to sit down. Don't really know how much of a difference it makes, but it is being done. This clip here is just beautiful. Two City fans, clearly mates, finally back in their grounds after three lockdowns over a year of watching it on the telly, which simply isn't the same. And you could just see the connection there between the players and the fans. It really is. It's how it should be. Ooh. Nearly went in too. Spurs fans getting excited here. City bantering. Straight in the wall. Blocked by Batungan. Oh, he's at the post. Big tackle. It's all kicking off at Wembley. What's the ref going to say? It's a yellow card. Spurs fans are over there. Both fans just singing their hearts out today. Score prediction full time. It's 0 0 right now, so we still have to It's going to go 0 0, and then it's going to. City are going to win on penalties. Oh, out of time, you go. I'm going to go 1 0 City. Mares. Oh my god. There's the shot. Yeah. Oh, what a save. That is an incredible save from Reese. One minute at a time before the break. That is half time in the game. City dominant as per usual. Spurs just sitting back trying to get counters here and there. But they look not on the same level as City. Not on the same wavelength, that's for sure. But the one thing that's been on form from both sets of fans is the atmosphere. In terms of restrictions and getting in, it was pretty easy. It was comfortable. It was a build of something that we can continue to do. It was, it was pretty calm. But no, apart from that, it's just one of those games. Low scoring, but hey, fans are back. Spurs fans over there, City over there. And that's the most amazing thing. And to be there for that game, history. It's like we're witnessing history here. Let's get on with the second half then. Oh, new angle. I noticed the later this game went on nil-nil, those Spurs fans over there just got that little bit more and more excited. Pep just having a word with his assistant. Now, see, this is the trouble. Oh, no, he's messed it up. Spurs could have scored that and strangled up the game. Bottled it. Gareth Bale is going on for Tottenham and Sissoko too. Time is ticking, lads. Oh, oh. It's a good run, that. What to say? Lloris has been unreal. Let's see if so.
82nd minute, Laporte, it just had to be. And look what it means to the City fans. Finally, they get to watch their football club again. Some of these players are just saying, well done to Fernandinho. Oh, he's, he's giving credit to the fans. That's brilliant. It's great to see. And there's the official attendance just below 8k i think it's about just below 4k nhs 2k city 2k spurs very well ran today as well some of them have given up Linesman's, Linesman's stopped the 90th minute party. Could have been 2-0 or 3 Riyad Mahrez. And the Carabao Cup goes to Manchester City. And look what it means to the fans. The players are loving it. The fans are well and truly back. We got Jack, City fan here. How do you feel, mate? How do you feel? You've just won the Carabao Cup. Over the moon. Yeah. Absolutely over the moon. Yeah. I'm, I'm glad we've done it. We made hard work of it. Yeah. We finally we've won it. Thanks to Laporte. I know, I know. You. Mate, you defended so well. Spurs never really looked like scoring, did they? Yeah, we, we played really well in the first half. Yeah. I thought it would come back to get us because we didn't take our chance in that first half. But... Yeah, my twin, as some people would say. You can see him in there in the black shirt, the black jumper, James Trafford. You really got a feel for these Spurs players. They really did work their ass off today, but City were just that bit too good. And here's them, you know, picking up those, uh, yeah, runners up medals. Son is not a happy. His son is not a happy man. Edison straight to the Champers. Imagine being a Spurs player right now, just having to watch through all this. What could have been? They love it. I can't believe I haven't got that camera. James Chaff has just been covered in champagne. He's fuming about it. Oh, man. Both sets of fans were incredible throughout. That is something, but only one team can win in the end. And of course, it was City as per usual. And it was great to see the players go to the fans because this is something that every club has missed out on. So here's where we are now. We started the week with billionaires trying to take over our sport. The fans won it back. And now we've seen a club win a trophy in front of 8,000 fans. After over a year of torture inside, three lockdowns, having to deal with so many losses, to see the light at the end of the tunnel is seriously special. Let's hope this is a gateway for more clubs all around the country of England to open up for fans and to let them watch the last few games of the season. Thank you for watching and good night.